requires extreme faith run. I solve it that way. If a function g of x is continuous on a closed interval a, b, then the function g of x has both a minimum and value and a maximum value on a closed interval a, b. Can't reach to your x when she says, please graph it that way. Tell me why it ain't nothing but a hell. Tell me why it ain't nothing but a mistake. Tell me why I never want to hear you say Derive it that way Am I the problem? We all values of X It's too late I'm going to bed Tell me why it ain't nothing but a headache Tell me why it ain't nothing but a mistake Tell me why I never wanna hear you say Derive it that way Intermediate value theorem for functions. If f of x is continuous on the closed interval a to b, then f of x takes on every value between f of a and f of b on closed interval a to b. If f of x is differentiable on a closed interval between a and b, then f prime of x takes on every value between f prime of a and f prime of b on a and b. Wrong! Wrong. Don't wanna Don't hear, hear that. But a headache ain't nothing but a mistake. I never wanna hear you say mean value theorem. Tell me why it must be continuous. Tell me why you must be differentiable. Tell me why I never. If f of x is continuous on the interval a, b, and differentiable on a, b, then for at least one x value c on a, b, the slope of the tangent line at c is equal to the slope of the, for, of the secant line connection a and b. Calculus is easy, cause I have a d.